This video is closed captioned. Top 10 largest airports in the world. Before the COVID-19 pandemic, 4.5 billion passengers traveled annually on 42 million flights. That number took a drastic dip in 2020 and has slowly been coming back. In 2021, passengers totaled 2.3 billion, with 28 million flights conducted. Although these numbers are still decidedly lower than in the past, there's no doubt that travel continues to rise and we learn to live with and navigate coronavirus. The world's largest airports took a massive hit to their businesses and are working diligently to encourage travelers to take to the skies once again. To do our part, let's inspire some wanderlust by reviewing 10 of the largest airports in the world. Number 10. Savarn Arbum International Airport Located in Bangkok, Thailand, Savarn Arbun International Airport is in a prime location to connect people to Europe, Asia, and more. Unofficially known as Bangkok Airport, it is one of the largest international airports in Southeast Asia, covering more than 8,000 acres. Just make sure you stay vigilant when traveling throughout this airport. Tourists and travelers often make easy targets for crime, but this transit area is worse than most. Illegal taxi drivers and tour guides belonging to established criminal groups prey on tourists in the arrival area. An expansion to the airport was planned for 2021 or 2022, but has been delayed to 2025 due to budget and COVID. It will increase the capacity of the airport by 44%. Number 9. Charles de Gaulle Airport France's Charles de Gaulle Airport is the largest international airport in France and opened its doors to passengers in 1974. In 2019, it was the world's ninth busiest airport and is the busiest airport in the European Union. That honor would have fallen to Heathrow in London except, you know, Brexit. An interesting claim to fame. The airport not only handled over 76 million passengers in 2019, but it also moved a whopping 2.1 metric tons of cargo. If you enjoy our videos, join us on our journey worldwide by subscribing to our channel. Please click the bell icon to get notified when we publish a new video. Number 8. Cairo International Airport Serving as the largest and busiest airport in Egypt, Cairo International Airport is the primary hub for Egypt Air and Nile Air and serves other airlines. As recently as 2020, it was named the busiest airport in Africa, seeing 15 million passengers. Because the area sees so much seasonal tourism, the airport's fourth terminal is strictly seasonal to account for the influx of traffic. To further support tourism, the airport opened a luxury five-star hotel in front of Terminal 3 in 2013. It is linked to the terminal via a 230-meter, 750-foot skyway with a convenient moving walkway. Number 7. Shanghai Pudong International Airport Located along the eastern Pudong coastline, this entry is one of two international airports in Shanghai, China. The airport also serves as critical transportation for cargo, with FedEx, UPS, and DHL each operating their hubs. In 2017, the airport had the distinction of being the third busiest airport based on cargo traffic. This airway thoroughfare opened the world's largest standalone satellite airport terminal buildings in 2019. These buildings will allow 38 million passengers annually and provide 90 departure gates. Number 6. Hartsfield Jackson Atlanta International Airport. We're judging the size of the Georgia based airport a bit differently. Although it might not have the most significant footprint of the airports on our list, it does manage an incredible 300,000 passengers daily. That totals over 100 million passengers each year. Between Delta Airlines using the airport as a hub and the geographical location of the airport in the southeastern United States, it's no wonder it's such a busy airport. For reference, the airport is within a two-hour flight of nearly 80% of the U.S. commercial population. Employing over 60,000 employees, they are the largest employer in the city of Atlanta. Number 5. Washington Dulles International Airport Operating as the airport closest to the United States Democratic Center of Washington, D.C., it moves 24 million passengers a year to the 125 destinations it serves. President Eisenhower selected the airport's location in 1958, and President Kennedy dedicated it in 1962. A truly unique feature you'll find if you travel through this airport are the 19 mobile lounges they operate. 
They are used to transport passengers to aircraft not attached to the main terminal. They protect travelers from inclement weather. And even today, only a couple of other airports use this mode of transportation. This airport can even host live performances from singers, musicians, and dancers, rounding out the cultural experiences available at the airport. Make sure to walk through the art and historical exhibits on your next layover, even if the timing isn't right to catch a live performance. Number 4. Dallas-Fort Worth International Airport This airport takes up plenty of space. It occupies two counties in Texas and touches portions of four different cities. The airport is larger than the island of Manhattan, New York, and ranks second in size for United States airports. The airport even has its own zip code and dedicated emergency services. The largest hub at the airport belongs to American Airlines, headquartered close by. Dallas-Fort Worth was granted a unique honor upon its opening in 1973. It hosted the first landing of a supersonic Concorde in the United States. Like many airports on our list, expansion plans are underway, but with ever-changing timelines due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Number 3. Denver International Airport Our number three spot is not only the largest airport in North America, but it is also the largest single employer in the state of Colorado where it resides. Although it is the third largest airport globally based on footprint, it falls much lower on the list of busiest airports. Still, nearly 70 million passengers use the airport in 2019. Number 2. King Fahad International Airport at nearly 300 square miles, Saudi Arabia's King Fahad International Airport would have come in first on any list until our number one airport opened in 2019. For 10 years, it reigned as the world's largest airport. Not surprisingly, the airport is named after the former king of Saudi Arabia, Fahad ibn Abal Aziz and manages travel for more than 10 million passengers each year. This is accomplished through three terminal buildings. A six-story terminal accommodates mainstream passengers. A second terminal supports private airlines. And a third terminal is reserved exclusively for the royal family of Saudi Arabia. The grounds were previously a U.S. air base used during the Gulf War, but now sports more civilian-friendly features. A mosque built on the car park's roof allows up to 2,000 worshippers and is surrounded by meticulous landscaping. The airport even sports its own plant nursery, including three greenhouses and nearly 400,000 square feet of green fields. The nursery supplies the airport's own aesthetic plant needs, creating a unique and sustainable source of flora. Number 1. Beijing Daxing International Airport in Beijing, China. This final entry on our list recently knocked the champion off their pedestal. Opening in September 2019, the Starfish-designed airport is expected to become the world's busiest, supporting 100 million passengers passing through by 2040. The airport boasts more than 7.5 million square feet, nearly doubling the terminal area of King Fahad International Airport. The building has some truly unique features built in. Because of its design, passengers can move from security to their gate in less than 10 minutes. Eco-friendly design elements are plentiful as well. The massive property will have a much smaller impact on surrounding ecosystems with solar panels, water management systems, and water heat recovery. Unfortunately, this airport had its grand opening not too long before COVID-19 changed the world, slowing travel to a mere crawl for months. While the world still navigates the coronavirus and its subvariants, we can't wait to see this airport operating at full capacity and living up to its expectations. We hope you enjoyed our list today. What airport from our list would you most like to experience firsthand? What large airports have you used that didn't make this list? Let us know down in the comments. Please don't forget to like and subscribe so you never miss a travel video. Until next time.